So we're here today on the shores of Little Lake in downtown Peterborough. Uh, beautiful day outside today and you know one of the things that I've learned uh, not being from Ontario originally is that Peterborough is by all means the gateway to cottage country and cottagers like everyone else face a variety of environmental issues. Uh, Mike tell me what are some of these concerns that cottagers are facing? Sure well they're concerned about the water quality of their lakes, they're concerned about uh, development pressures on their lakes as well mm -hmm. um, and uh, for the last nine years we've been exploring some of these issues at the Lakeland Conference and this year's conference is coming up on Saturday September 19th uh, and it will run from 8.30 till 3.30 in the afternoon mm -hmm. and um, yeah, so we, we've been getting a, a great turnout of, of concerned uh, shoreline property owners to you know, coming out to learn more about some of these issues. Um, what are you going to be talking about specifically this year at the conference? Sure, yeah, we're, we're going to be looking at and focusing on some of the uh, community-based initiatives of these lake associations. Okay. Um, and they've, they've become quite, uh, quite active and uh, quite effective in, in, in their stewardship efforts. Um, give me an example of some of these uh, activities that cottage owners associations and other groups have been doing. Sure. Well, uh, lake associations have been getting uh, active in terms of uh, doing some lake planning. Mm -hmm. um, and these are uh, plans that uh, lake association will put together um, and uh, that kind of encompass, you know, specific characteristics about that lake. Um, and they become living documents that, uh, that the association will use to interact with their municipalities and, and that they hope will um, have an impact on how uh, development takes place on that lake. So, Okay, is there anything else of note we should definitely want sure, to find out about sure. at this Ab year's conference? Absolutely. Um, we'll be talking about um, the community initiatives of the uh, Halliburton and the Bancroft areas. Um, fish hatcheries. Mm -hmm. uh, these are uh, volunteer driven initiatives uh, that uh, they're working to uh, maintain a healthy stock of, of lake trout in the area's lakes. Okay. Um, so some pure genetic strains that they're, they're, pr um, that they're propagating. Mm -hmm. uh, and like I said, it's, it's also a community-based uh, effort. So we're going to be uh, talking to some of the, uh, some of the organizers of, 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 those, of those initiatives. Uh, we'll also be talking about uh, Lake Algal Blooms with uh, Anna DeSalas from the Ministry of the Environment. We'll be talking about um, uh, keeping the cottage in the family, which can be a challenge. Uh, uh, we'll be having Peter Lillico, who's an estate planning lawyer. We'll be talking about that as well. And then we'll also be uh, talking about uh, wetland uh, uh, pressures, uh, or development pressures on wetlands that are uh, that uh, a lot of times are associated with uh, uh, with. Our, our lakes as well. So. Exactly, and I understand there's something really cool. It's weather and art, and we're not going to be giving Jay Scotland a crayon, are we? <laughs> no, no. Uh, it's, uh, it's a talk um, uh, being given by an artist uh, that's going to be called Forensic Meteorology, where weather and art meet. So it should be an interesting discussion about uh, you know looking at a piece of art uh, and looking at the weather that's actually taking place in that in that piece in that moment in time, and so that should be an interesting discussion. A little bit of a departure from what we normally talk about, but I'm, I'm sure people will find that uh, quite interesting and entertaining. So, how can we find out more about this event, Mike? Sure. You can contact me at Peterborough Greenup at 745-3238. My extension is 207, or you can check us out online at www.lakelandalliance.net, or email me at lakelandalliance at kojiko.net. All right, sounds like a great event. I can't wait to attend. Great, thanks. And we'll see you again next week on The Green Update. The Green Update is brought to you by the City of Peterborough. Peterborough is a great place to cycle, on the trails, to work, to school, or to a friend's house. Get out and get active by cycling. A message from the City of Peterborough.